Another initiative that the mayor is pushing involves some substantial overhauls to the police department in San Francisco. KTVU's Christian Captain explains the mayor's proposed ballot initiative aimed at restoring some key police powers. San Francisco's mayor, London Breed, says she wants voters to decide how the city will respond to crime. She's putting forth a ballot measure, Save for San Francisco, that she says will expand police powers and get rid of red tape slowing officers down. Now we are going to the voters and say, voters of San Francisco, this is what's happening. These are the basic tools we need to improve public safety in San Francisco. Support Safer SF today. The mayor says her measure would streamline paperwork and procedures to get officers out on the streets more quickly and would broaden department use of new technology, including surveillance cameras and drones in pursuits and to solve crimes. Police Chief Bill Scott says the changes would make an immediate impact on his department's ability to track down and catch criminals. He pointed to the fact that San Francisco currently lacks air support to track down suspects after a crime is committed. We don't have it, so if we had the ability to have drones at the end of a foot pursuit, we get in foot pursuits all the time. Our perimeters, we have technology and drones that helped us find, that would help us find the person we're looking for. That's a huge, huge thing for us. The ballot measure would effectively work around the Board of Supervisors and Police Commission. While three supervisors stood in support of the mayor's plan, others say they need to see the plan before deciding whether or not they support it. The Electronic Frontier Foundation, a watchdog in the digital space, says it has concerns about the proposed ballot measure, which they say would weaken community control over police use of surveillance technology, saying in part, quote, putting communities under a microscope with high-tech surveillance will inevitably hurt those communities that are already the most policed, surveilled, and marginalized. The mayor's safer San Francisco measure is set to go on the ballot in March of next year. In San Francisco, Christian Kaftan, KTVU, Fox 2 News.